Uh, hello everyone, this is Anoop and as I said, I'm going to show you how to draw a force velocity curve and by the way, I'm using Excel 2011 uh, if you're using Excel 2010 and 2007 it might be a bit different as you can see, I have written down the load values on the A, column A I have the velocity values on column B now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to select all the numbers here and I'm going to click insert on the top and then I'm going to select the chart type called scatter plot so there you can see you can see on the X axis is our load and on the Y axis is the velocity now now we have to make sure that we have that line so what we do is that we click on one of the dots right click and we select add trend line and we select an exponential trend line. Uh, now what we see here is the force velocity curve. Uh, once we do that we can change the chart title by clicking on the chart title and then rewriting it as force velocity curve uh, to change the title the x-axis what we do is that uh, click on the x-axis go to the design up on top and up to your left side you click on the add chart element you go to axis title you click primary horizontal and you name that as load and you put the units in pounds in brackets and you can do the same thing uh, for the y-axis too and that's all I have for the force velocity curve uh, you can plot the power curve too in here but it's a bit more complicated because you have uh, to draw a third uh, vertical axis but if you have any questions email me or uh, see me in class I'll talk to you later bye